theater, everyone. So, Cheeks Up, that's an interactive face motion game for children. The human face has more than 20 muscles, what's involved in speaking, eating, and showing emotions. But when it comes to disability, that's a hard work to get better, especially for children, because motivation is crucial. And to make them these silly exercises uh, routinely every day, it takes a lot of effort and it's extremely boring. So we are automating this process, giving the control functions to the computer and uh, exercise example, providing with the game graphic and with the gamified experience making this fun. So collect the strawberries when you've reached the needed amount of your motion with the tongue. Uh, to make this work, you have to get a 3D camera because that data is necessary. And uh, built-in solutions are already avail available in the market. That would make our distribution easier. Uh, our main competitors are conventional therapy methods because similar solutions are not yet available in the market. Now we are building and developing. We can show you a small smile recognition demo, uh, but our final uh, prototype version will be ready by the end of this year. And uh, if we're talking about the market, the children in need are 10% of all healthy children. So it's 2.4 million in America, 3 million in Europe. But if it's used as a learning tool, how it can be used, that it can help for a whole lot better, uh, for more people. And uh, our business model would be based on subscription fee. And uh, we will open our markets through institutions, so it's rehabilitation centers, kindergartens, nurseries, where we can uh, get access to our direct customers, what will be parent. Now, at this moment, we have a little bit of traction, few potential customers, and uh, a little bit of funding. But we are looking for more. We have a great team, all professionals, and all the good people who have money, please contact us, call me, contact me any way you want. We will be very happy to talk to you. Cheeks up and never let them down. Thank you. Um, so what is the pricing model right now? You said it's a subscription, but how much do you want to have for this from your customers? Yeah, uh, it depends from the country because this service is uh, uh, funding models uh, really different. So in uh, Eastern Europe, uh, it's like government funded more. In the UK, uh, it's uh, government and privately, and it, the prices are different. But at this moment, we are counting on uh, 30 months a euro, uh, 30 euros a month, and uh, if comparing to one um, therapy session, what it's more than 100 euros, it's nothing. And the typical child will use this for a year or longer or less? It depends from the disability, but it starts from few months, like two, three months. If it's very easy to get on, then it's two, three months. But usually it, can, it, it goes two, three, if it's a neurological problem that can be a lot more like uh, years, five, ten, it depends. And these games and therapy games are medically validated by psychologists and neurologists? I am a speech therapist okay. from Latvia. And I, like this was a pain in my work because I worked in rehabilitation center and the half of the board was uh, this kind of exercises and my lips already get pumped from the moving all the, all the day around. And is there any, any sort of goal to also release the mobile app? Is there a possibility to release, release a mobile app for the therapy? Uh, we hope that it will be available in future, but we have really good hopes for that because time of flight technology, what this camera with the 3D, they are already integrated in the tablets. So we have a computer, uh, but it's coming going into the tablets, and uh, we hope it will be in mobile phones. Arr!